History is important. If we think about the old adage, you don't pay attention to history, you're doomed to repeat it. Any history is important to preserve. And in this particular case, this is history about a world war that took place over 100 years ago. To many people, it's, it's ancient history. And so technology becomes even more valuable or invaluable as we shape and tell the story of what took place in, in the first truly global conflict in human history. The National World War I Museum and Memorial holds the most comprehensive collection of World War I artifacts and objects and material culture in the world. And that truly makes uh, this organization and this museum a memorial unique and unlike anything else found uh, anywhere else in the world. When you're dealing with a world-class museum, everything is important. There's no cutting corners. There are, are critical eyes looking at every exhibit and every piece of technology we're putting in. They listen to what it is that we're looking for and find solutions that sometimes are out of the box. The screens, the technology brings the information to life. We have a, a lot of interactive elements here at the Museum of Memorial and when you see uh, children look into a recreation of a trench and hear audio recordings of soldiers talking about their experiences. When they turn away, you, you can see it on their faces, just how meaningful that is to them. You can see the cognitive learning that's going on when they use the interactive tables to build their own propaganda poster or in our Kemper Horizons Theater, which really brings to life what took place in World War I through a massive diorama and, and lighting and different exposures. It just makes people understand that the history is not just in a textbook, but in a way you really can recreate it and bring it to life, which just has so much more meaning for the visitors we see here at the National World War I Museum and Memorial.